<coughs> um, hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing, um, my keyboard review. So, um, this is the Razer Hutzman Mini with linear red switches and it also, it, it's the Mercury white one, as you can tell. Um, there's going to be a sound test at, I don't know, who knows when. Um, but I'm going to be doing a mouse review in the next vid, hopefully. Um, but yeah, um, I think the price is around about like $219, but you just won't regret buying it because it's, um, well, oh, I'm bleeding because <laughs> it's very like stable, I guess. This is definitely an upgrade from the, uh, from the Razer Hutzman Mini with purple switches. This is an upgrade because, listen to this, this isn't, like, bad, but, yeah, they, well, we'll do a sound test now, might as well. Um, yeah, that's what it sounds like. It also has a pretty good, um, oh, let me just try out plug it. Pretty good uh, plug in thing. Like, it has a personal one, but this is decently good because it could fit basically any, any, anything in there because it's fat. And, uh, I'll take off the keycaps and show you. This is linear reds, and it also has a special. You just can't see it. Focus. You razor emblem there. Got a sticker. Um, I didn't get to show you the unboxing of it, but um, I'll get to that. Not get to it because I'm not gonna fill out the box and warranty and everything. But, um, yeah, I'm going to show you the, there's also function key since it is a 60%, so there's FN control, so you press FN, right there, FN, and then these are the movement keys, because you can see it's got little labels at the bottom, movement keys, um, macros, that's gamer mode, and then there's all the F1, FF, Brightness, you could also change your brightness on your, see, just went all the way down, all up. And if you want to change your colours, so FN, control, and say so 1 turns it off. 2, you could change to green. 2 again, it changes the different colours. And then 3 is that, and it just keeps on switching. Any different colours and four pink and that five is my favourite. The rainbow. That's what I always use. There is a six, isn't there? Yeah, there's six, so with the six you that each one you type. It goes you know? It goes that. Like, Look, I'll show you, see that, click, F, D, now each one you press you go like that. There's all the function keys, there's a night mode, I don't know what that does, I haven't experimented with that. There's Windows key, there's a bunch of stuff, basically. 
Oh, they thought, but let's just see, I put some stickers there. So, um, underneath it, you could either change it to 6 inches higher on both sides, or you could change it to 9 inches and flip these ones up. 9, eight, nine inches, 6 inches. Flat. Um, you could also customise it if you have a PC or like a laptop that you play on with it. You, um, which I don't, I play on PS4, so. Oh, that's a good thing, it's compatible with all consoles, so that's good. Um, yeah, that, that's going to be the video. Um, if you do end up getting the purple clicky ones, I would recommend, this wouldn't fix the whole keyboard, but it would make it, um, a bit better. So, we'll see how... You take off the bottom and then there's like screws there. And there's going to be a bunch of screws. Like screws, screws and you take all of them off and then take the cover out. And then there's just going to be this plug. You unplug that softly, safely. And then you put foam in there and then you screw it back in from the back on out. Make it still have the clicky feeling but it'll feel good because the purple one is like... You can see like the spring. It's like really springy, so yeah. Well, um, that's gonna be the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, yeah. By the way, shout out to my friend Tommy XO. He gave me this idea. He's just inspired me. He was the uh, yeah. He he actually surprisingly inspired me to do YouTube. It's crazy, but yeah. Get him to 5k, because he's not at 4k yet, but get him to 5k. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe if you do, with notifications on, um, so you could stay tuned. I wish I could say use code whatever in item store, but I don't have 1k subs. But um, yeah. This is going to be my review. If, if, when I hit 200 subs, or 100, I'll do, yeah. When I hit 100 subs, I'll do a face reveal. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And, no, noties on if you want to stay tuned. I'd stream daily. Um, yeah. Thanks for watching. Peace.